Hi guys, so I was not planning on vlogging today, but I just got in the mood to put up my Christmas decor, so figured I'd pick up the camera and we would decorate for Christmas. Scarlett is sitting over here. She's eating some lunch, because it is lunchtime. It's almost 12 o'clock. What are you eating for lunch, my dear? Are you eating pizza? Yeah, yeah it's your favorite, huh? I need to give her something else too, but so far, just pizza. So here's the deal. I'm gonna decorate for Christmas or at least start like getting everything out and seeing what we have. I know everybody has an opinion on when you should decorate, when you shouldn't decorate, but for our family, we're decorating right now. It is the beginning of November, but the reason I wanna decorate is because we're gonna be gone in December for almost half of December, not half of it, but for like two weeks in December. And I wanna be able to enjoy our Christmas decor, so we're gonna put it up a little bit early since we won't be here. So that's my plan. Um, we also have a repair guy coming over like any minute because we have a clogged sink and he's doing a few other things for us. So busy, busy afternoon, but I have a predicament and I'm gonna show you what it is. Okay. Guys, our garage is a mess. Please do not judge us. This is like all furniture from our spare bedroom that we cleaned out, but that is where all my Christmas decor is, way up there. So, you know, I could wait until Ty gets home and have him help me, but being the person that I am, I'm just gonna do it myself and <laughs> try my best to get everything out of the attic. We'll see how that goes. But right now I'm just trying to pick up our living room area, get everything clean so I can start bringing Christmas stuff in. I'm so excited. I'm excited. To get the tree up. Um, I have two Christmas trees to put up, by the way. This is Scarlett's toy. And magically my house is decorated. <laughs> just kidding, okay. Time to, time to get serious. Okay, let's just see. Oh, I'm so freaked out. And I'm scared. I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared there's bugs. Somebody asked me how I got all of this stuff down from my attic. Somebody asked me, because I don't have an answer for you. Instead of bringing the boxes down, I ended up just opening the boxes in the attic and grabbing each piece, so it was a lot easier. Um, I also have another Christmas tree. It's just in the garage still, but she's just about ready for a nap, aren't you? Aren't you ready for a nap? Yeah. on the wrong way. I think I put this part where it's supposed to go right here, so I have to fix that. is a nine foot tree I can't remember but it is massive um, it also changes it has LED lights so it changes like this um, or you can have just color or just the yellow lights we got this tree last year I need to do something about that top I just can't reach it too I feel like I'm gonna have to bring the ladder in but got the tree up so I will start decorating when she takes a nap because I've been lazy and just haven't put her down yet and it is almost I think one o'clock so are you ready to take a nap now yeah. Okay, let's go lay down. We've been saying you're gonna take a nap forever. Good girl. Okay, that was easy. Go lay down in your bed. Guys, my house is a disaster right now. Oh, um, excuse me. Uh, Scarlet, can I come in please? I have milk, I'm bringing milk. Yeah. Yeah, look at all these babies on your bed. Oh my gosh, you guys, have you ever seen my house messier? A lot of babies. Should we clean some of them up or you wanna sleep with all of them? Okay, whatever. Oh, do you you need to put underwear on, or not underwear, a diaper or pull up or something. She doesn't have anything on because potty training. I got your milk. Here. Love you. Okay. That was way too easy to put her down. It's been a lot more challenging these past couple days, but today, for some reason, it wasn't. Maybe it's because I put her down so late, but 
I'm like out of breath because this is so much work. Um, I just got a call from our the repair guy who's coming over to fix our sink and he should be here any minute. So I'm gonna have to pause on the Christmas decor and um, take care of this. My friend Krista Bowman Ruth showed me this and I'm obsessed with it now. So yeah, we'll just turn on the fireplace. Check it out. Got a fireplace going. In my okay, this is overwhelming. So I'm gonna quickly show you guys everything that I have. I'm gonna do a full like Christmas house tour. So I'm just gonna quickly walk through everything and then I'll show you guys all of it up in that separate video. Um, and there's actually a lot of stuff I still need to go get now that I'm looking at everything. But I have two wreaths right here. Um, a bunch of these little trees. I actually had all of these for Scarlett's first birthday party last year, so I have all those. I obviously like a lot of green in my Christmas. Um, I have just a few signs. This is all stuff from last year. I have these. Um, I showed you guys these in one of my last videos. But these right here, these are so pretty. So I have two frames. Oh my gosh, I almost knocked that down. I'll just show you guys these when they're up. But my mother-in-law actually gave me these and I just, I love them. They're like old fashioned Santa Claus pictures. Then I have a bunch of trees, some just random decor. Um, I have banners, some tea lights, a bunch of, what do you call these? <laughs> um garlands and then i don't think i'm gonna put this up this was from scarlett's first birthday too um a joy sign snow carpet i have our stockings but i really want to replace these this year i just don't know if we will um i'm kind of over the red and green theme this goes to our other christmas tree which i think i'm going to put up in our bedroom like we did last year and we have two christmas trees so i put all of the fun ornaments on one christmas tree and then on this one it's like more of our decorative christmas tree my mom gave me a ton of ornaments last year. I actually made this when I was, I don't even know, just a few years old. Um, but she gave me all of these sentimental ornaments and I just love them. They're so awesome. Brings back memories. All of these ornaments are just like sentimental ornaments that I made when I was little or that we got for Scarlet or that my grandma got us, just random things like that. Down here I have a bunch of just greenery garland and then I have a bunch of this white garland which I think I might put on the tree. I don't even know where our ornaments are at. Maybe they're in this box. I thought this wasn't Christmas stuff. This is like New Year's. I actually found some fall stuff in here that I didn't even realize I had but um, too late now. I'm gonna clean everything with my Mrs. Meyers peppermint scent. I love this scent. It's one of my absolute favorites and I haven't even used this yet. I'm losing motivation. I'm starting to like, uh, this is a lot of work. I am getting frustrated because a lot of the stuff I have, I just don't love anymore. And because my style has changed a lot. I feel like it's changed a lot in the past like two years. And a lot of my Christmas stuff is old. So I'm getting frustrated with some of this stuff and I just can't make it look how I want it to look. But I also don't want to spend hundreds of dollars on <laughs> Christmas decor because we have a birthday party to plan. So I'm just gonna take a break. I'm drinking organic cold pressed Fuji apple spiced cider by Trader Joe's. It's actually really, really good. Um, it has cinnamon and clove. So I'm taking a break, drinking some of this, and then I'm gonna get back to work. I'm dreading dressing the tree. Like that is what I'm putting off, but that's what I'm gonna do next. Update on the Christmas decor. I'm on my second Christmas tree that's going in our bedrooms. So this is what I'm gonna work on now. Uh, this is still a mess, but I have this done, and then I have this decorated, and then that area decorated, and then this is like whatever, but, and then I have our tree all dressed. So I'm making progress. Scarlett's over here having a little snack. Do you have a good nap, baby? Yeah, yeah she's eating some goldfish crackers and watching a show. Can we help you? Here, hang on. Look, 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 this goes like this. It's already one on it. Okay, now we just hang it from the tree. Should we hang it right here? Unwrap some, see what's in this one. What's that? Oh, that's Indy's paw print. That's Indy. You wanna hang it up? Be really careful. Grandma gave me this. Yeah. Let me put it up there. Where should we put it? This. Right there? Yeah. A little lamb? My little girl, should we hang it up? Yeah. Okay, let's put it right over here. Hang it right here. 
So I actually made this when I was a little kid and this was a Christmas list and it says that on my Christmas list there is a Game Boy, a Sega game, basketball, a baby sister, well my mom gave me plenty of those, uh, my own room, that's all. <laughs> How funny is that? My mom gave me a bunch of these ornaments last year and I just, I love them. This one is really special. This is Indy's paw print we did for his first Christmas. Well, this is probably my favorite ornament ever. Um, this is my mom and I, Christmas 1994. So I was Scarlett's age here. Does she look like me? Yeah, this was exactly the same age. I guess I was two and a half here because my birthday's in July, but um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. It's four o'clock, you guys. I've been doing this seriously all day, but that's okay. Um, I wanted to show you what I just did because it turned out really cute. Okay, so I showed you guys this in one of my last vlogs. Um, I bought this little house on sale at, at home for $3, and I said I was gonna make my own little DIY wreath, and I thought it turned out really cute. So what I did is I just cut off um, like three of these little pieces, and then I twisted them together and then I just used a, um, what do you call that, a zip tie and then put it right there. Thought it turned out really cute. Oh, thank you. She's been such a good sport today, haven't you? What, would you like up? Yeah. Okay, you have to say what you want. Do you want Santa Claus to come visit you? Yeah. You do? Okay. You bring you toys? Yeah. But we don't have a chimney. How is he gonna get inside? How, how is Santa Claus gonna bring you his toys? Pony. He's gonna bring you a pony? Yeah. Oh, oh is he? <laughs> She's been so good today. Well, I have been busy decorating. She's been keeping herself busy. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, aren't you? Aren't I? Daddy. You know, Daddy, you know what? I have something fun for you to do. You wanna do it? Yeah. You wanna paint a snowman? Okay, let's paint a snowman. Yeah. Okay, go sit in your high chair. I got this little snowman thinking I could use this while decorating. Um, I got this at the Target dollar spot. So it's gonna come in handy right now while I just finish up everything. Get up on in there. Here, actually, let me help you. Help. Scarlett, if you need to go potty, you're gonna have to tell me I need to go potty, okay? Okay. Okay. Because I can let you out, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, so this is a snowman yeah. that you're gonna paint. You got a bunch of different colors. What color is this? White. White. What color is this? Pink. Pink. And what color is this? Pink. You have three colors. Let's start. Okay, I have no idea where to hang up our stockings because we don't really have a mantle or a fireplace or anything. So let's go figure this out. So my initial thought is put them right here on command hooks. I don't love it, but I don't really have another option to be honest. I want them close to the tree and there's nowhere over here. I need like a like one of those stocking hangers just to set right here, but I think I'm just gonna put them here for now. I think it'll work, whatever. I'm over it, I just want everything put away. What are you doing? Why are you painting your face? Okay guys, my house is not clean, but I'm just gonna give you a really quick walkthrough just so I don't leave you guys hanging and I will go through and like show you guys more detail um, in a separate video, but I have all my Christmas stuff put up. Kitchen, this little area. I think Ty's calling me. Um, here is like the Christmas area. I really don't like this tree skirt, but it's what I got. So it's what's gonna happen right now. You guys, my house, like I can't even deal. Okay, this right here, this little setup, isn't this just lovely in my living area? <laughs> that just, it gets used daily, so that's why that's there. Um, I hung those up there, don't love it, but whatever. Oh, are you gonna clean up for me? Yeah. Okay. And then I'll show you in here. This is also a mess, um, but we have our little sentimental Christmas tree over here. <laughs> this has been so much work, but I hope you guys enjoyed decorating with me. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Also stay tuned for a full like 
Christmas decor walkthrough, home tour, something like that. I don't know. Um, I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna call it or how I'm going to do it yet, but stay tuned for that. I'll go into more detail about everything. But uh, I have like random chairs sitting in my kitchen because I've been hanging things up. But uh, we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.